Deidre Hall is a name synonymous with daytime television. She'll actually be appearing in her 5,000th episode as Dr. Marlena Evans on Days of Our Lives today. Deidre first joined Days of Our Lives in 1976, and she's here to tell us more about reaching this milestone and to share some of her favorite memories. Deidre, welcome to The Morning Show in Canada. I'm so proud of you all. <laughs> <laughs> It's oh nice goodness. to be with you. I, I'm, not, I'm very glad we got together. We are so thrilled to have you here on TMS, and congratulations on reaching this milestone. 5,000 episodes today. Come on, shut up. I, 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 when they told me, I thought, yeah, okay, that feels like 5,000, and I had no idea that it was momentous. So I've, I've been schooled with everybody else about 5,000. Deidre, uh, which is your favorite episode? Because honestly, I was looking back, I thought you were outstanding in episode 3719. <laughs> Remind me which one that was, Jeff. Right. I, I believe that was the one that you were possessed by the devil. <laughs> um, my favorite one. Is that a serious question? Because I do have favorite ones. Yeah, for sure, Deidre, it's a serious <laughs> question. Because, I mean, Dr. Marlena Evans has been through it all in 5,000 episodes. I mean, you've been possessed by the devil twice, brainwashed into thinking you were the Salem stalker at one point, and of course, who could forget waking up from a coma? Is there a favorite storyline? Do you have a favorite one over those uh, last 5,000? You know, I, I love the hu humane stories. I love these stories of family. I love the holiday stories. Um, at one point, I worked with my twin sister. Uh, that was extraordinary. Um, a, that had never been done in, in, in daytime uh, or in television before, except for, I guess, the old, whatever. But but in daytime, because it hadn't been done. And suddenly, and Marcus said, you know, what would you like to do? I said, work with my twin. Once you have a twin, how soon can she be here? There that was. Um, and it, it um, was fabulous because I got to live with her for about a couple of years. And because, um, ironically, she was a special education teacher with an advanced degree. And being in, in daytime for a few years enabled her to pay off her college loan. Wow. I mean, that's, there we are. What a country. Oh, wait, I, we're in Canada. Never mind. <laughs> okay, I have to ask you about one storyline that Jeff just mentioned, because it really is on par with who shot JR, and that's Marlena's possession. In fact, people may not know this, but in 2015, the Smithsonian Institute got the script for that storyline, along with other memorabilia from days into the collection there, how does it feel to have it recognized as part of television history? Smithsonian was breathtaking to me. You know, Greg Meng and I went there and, and helped install it. It was just, uh, that's, that's the moment where you pinch yourself. Come on, come on. Um, but I guess it is, it is a classic. It is legendary. Um, had not been ever done in television before, and daytime doesn't have all the all the the tools one might need to pull that off, and yet we did. Um, so it was I, I was deeply touched and moved by that. And I should tell you, since you brought it up, that Who Shot Jr. was a, was a story that my ex husband had written. Wow. Doesn't bear going into, but just when you said I went, oh, Steve wrote that. Okay, Deidre, gotta ask you about your Canadian fans and the Canadian fans of Days of Our Lives over the years and over these five thousand episodes. Could you talk to us a bit about that and maybe some memories of coming here to Canada? You know, um, uh, our fans are just are once again legend, and they follow us no matter where we go. They accept us no matter what we do. And um, that's my favorite thing about the fans. They're in their game. They're playing right along with us. So to everybody in Canada, thanks so much for, for hanging in there with us. Thanks for staying tuned. Uh, I know we, we jumped to, to um, uh, streaming at one point. Um, so I know that was a tricky transition. Thank you for staying. And uh, we just love you to pieces. All right. So what's next for Marlena? We are about six months ahead of you. We've already shot Halloween. Um, what's next for Marlena? Well, I could tell you what I did this week, but then you'd be six months ahead. <laughs> I think you're going to have to stay tuned. I, that's all I can tell you. All right. Well, we will. We will uh, for sure. Before we let you go, uh, Deidre, we have to ask, uh, how are you celebrating this 5,000th episode today? Uh, are you going to watch it? You know what? I, I'm, uh, I think there's something happening on stage on Friday. So uh, I'll be looking forward to that. 
Oh, gosh, such a pleasure. Only Deidre has connections to two of the two biggest storylines in television, which I love. <laughs> Deidre, such a pleasure. Thank you. Thank you so much, Carolyn. All right, and just a reminder, you can catch the iconic Deidre Hall today, celebrating 5,000 episodes, and of course, every weekday on Days of Our Lives, airing on Stack TV or anywhere you watch W Network.